Today we're going to be chatting about one of the most common misconceptions that I see on the forums and that's the difference between waxers and polishers. I'll often see someone using the term polish when they've waxed something, waxed when they've polished something. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to explain the difference between the two products and then I'm going to go into different types of products you can buy and more modern solutions to, for example, the wax. Now, a polish is a cutting compound. However fine it may be, if it's a finishing compound or a, a cutting compound, but ultimately they've all got a slight abrasion in there. Now, your hand polishers, such as this Auto Glim Super Resin Polish, a very fine polish designed to be used with a cloth, uh, also similar to the T-Cut. Now, you've got your heavier cutting compounds, which is your machine polish type compounds. We've, we've got one here, Advanced Cutting Compound. Um, all these are going to be putting very slight scratches into your paintwork. We do that to remove the larger scratches. So we're slowly taking back layers of the of the clear coat in order to get to a point where that scratch is, is no longer there. Now, you, you usually do that in stages. So you start with a cutting compound, go to a lighter cutting compound, and then with a the finishing compound. Now, the difference with, with, the, with, the, uh, with the polish and the wax is that a wax has no cutting capability whatsoever. A wax is a glaze. A wax is an extra layer that goes on top of your paintwork to protect it. Now, as far as waxes are concerned, I rarely use wax. I've rarely used, well, probably the last time I used wax was probably about two years ago. I stock a little cheap pot of wax just in case my customer specifically requires wax for his application. But where, where most applications are concerned, I'm going to use a spray-on sealant. I stock my own spray-on sealant. Um, obviously, I highly recommend this product. Um, but it's as far as costing and time is concerned, these types of things are the future. The next step on from the spray on sealant is ceramic coating. Now we, uh, we have a ceramic coating here from IGL Coatings. Uh, this, is, this is the next level in coating, coating technology. This is going to put up to a five year coat on the vehicle. Now, if you're interested in applying ceramic coating, it's, uh, it's, it's not something that you should take on without preparing for it, for example, this, uh, this company IGL won't provide you this coating unless you can prove that you're A, qualified and B, you have a sanitary environment to apply the coating in. Because if you don't if you don't apply that in a sanitary environment and something lands into that coating, that's going to be there for the duration of the coat. The best interim for the, for the basic user or the hobbyist is the spray-on sealant. Uh, there's many other spray-on sealants like it. Again, this is a quality product. You'll use this, this sealant uh, to initially coat the car and then you use a top-up spray on, the, on your maintenance washers. Um, the ease of application it is simply spray on, wipe off. It is, it is that simple. Whereas your traditional waxes, you are putting it on with an applicator pad, you're then leaving it to set and then it, it's, sometimes, it's sometimes quite difficult to buff the residue of the wax off when you're buffing it, you're applying a bit too much pressure to the paintwork than you sh should really be doing, potentially putting more scratches back in there, even though the aim of the whole process was to protect your car. So I hope I've cleared up a bit of confusion there with what a lot of people consider waxes and polishers. If you've got any questions to do with what we've just discussed today, then please feel free to drop a comment below. If you're interested in what you're seeing here, then please subscribe to the channel. You can see us on Facebook. You can also pick up some of these products and some quality cloths from our website, which will be linked below. Thanks very much.